Cancer Early Signs and Symptoms Cancer is a disease where genetic changes cause cells to grow and multiply more than they should. These abnormal cells can form tumors, which may spread to other parts of the body, a process known as metastasis. Let's move on to the general signs and symptoms of cancer that everyone should be aware of. Remember, if you have any of these symptoms, make an appointment with your healthcare professional. It's always better to be safe and get things checked out early. Number one, feeling extremely tired without a clear reason can be a sign. It's normal to feel tired after a long day or poor sleep, but unexplained fatigue that doesn't improve should be checked out. Number two, pain without a clear cause, especially if it lasts three weeks or more, needs to be investigated. Number three, any unexplained bleeding, whether in saliva, stools, urine, vomit, or vaginal discharge should prompt a visit to your healthcare professional. Number four, any new lumps or changes in existing lumps should be checked by a healthcare professional. Number five, occasional night sweats can be normal, but if you're waking up drenched regularly without a clear cause, get it checked out. Next, let's discuss symptoms related to the respiratory system. Number one, a cough lasting three weeks or more, especially without a clear reason, should be checked, even if you've recovered from an illness like corona. Number two, persistent breathlessness not related to exercise or known conditions like asthma needs medical attention. Number three, a hoarse voice lasting more than three weeks should be investigated. Now, let's talk about skin-related symptoms. Number one, new moles or changes in existing moles, such as itching, bleeding, or changes in size should be checked. Number two, sores that don't heal within a few weeks, whether on the skin or in the mouth, need medical attention. Number three, get used to examining your skin and nails regularly. Look for any unusual changes, such as black lines in your nails. Let's move on to symptoms related to eating and weight. Number one, if you have trouble swallowing food or experience frequent choking, consult your healthcare provider. Number two, regular heartburn or indigestion, especially if you're over 55 or experiencing weight loss, needs medical evaluation. Number three, a persistent lack of appetite should be discussed with a healthcare professional. Number four, significant weight loss without trying should be checked by a healthcare provider. Finally, let's cover symptoms related to bladder and bowel habits. Number one, if you feel bloated for three weeks or more, even if it comes and goes, see your healthcare professional. Number two, any changes in your bowel or bladder habits should prompt a medical consultation. Conclusion, cancer is a challenging topic but being aware of these signs and symptoms can make a big difference. Remember, experiencing these symptoms doesn't mean you have cancer, but it's important to get them checked out. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please like, subscribe, and share it with others.